And welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Fallout 3. I'm joined as always by Admiral Thunderbolt. And we do have a special guest with us today. Hello everybody. Lucas13. I know you miss me more. Yeah. Yes. Just like a Damn it, Peabody. We are still in the Citadel. We're looking for Rothschild. Here he is. What's up? Well, it's good to see yeah. you on your feet again. In his balding head. Wow, look at that coma. I think that's a coma. <laughs> Uh, it looks like it could be. It's one of the worst ones I've you're, ever seen. You're not fooling anybody, bro. Just saying. <laughs> we all know you're bald. We all know you're bald. Said so you give me the details. Um. Wait, this is the uh. The after the big climax of the last one. What did you think of the giant robot? I have to ask. The giant robot was cool. But it was slow as hell, and I I felt like I wasn't helping at all. <laughs> I was just like, why, why am I even here? Go go it's robots! Like, oh, what's going on, guys? Just, that's boom. <laughs> <laughs> I I tried to shoot I a couple really people. I, <laughs> why did they even need anyone else's help? No, I know that, that robot honing shit. It was. It was ridiculous. <laughs> they, yeah, they just kept on saying, "We need you to make sure that it lives." <laughs> I'm like, I think it's doing fine. I wouldn't worry too much about it. Yeah, especially the part where it grabbed the gates and ripped them up and just started twisting metal. And I was just sitting there like, you know what? I th I think it's okay. Uh, yeah, I think I he's going to... I don't think you guys need him here. Yeah, I think he's going to be fine. Uh, I, I, I'm tempted to make so many Xenogears references that you don't know right now. Damn you. I won't ruin what happens, but... uh Let's just say more stuff. More stuff involves that. I. Oh, Xeno Gears made him made him stop. Xeno Gears, man. Xeno Gears. Xeno Gears. Oh God. <laughs> Damn it. Oh no. I still want to write. Oh. Oh God. Is he still talking? And I can't like click through it. I'm not uh, listening like at all. To be honest with you, this is how the game gets you with cutscenes. Yeah, I know. At least this time I'm in the right position. I I fail at that most times. Like all of a sudden the game freezes me, and I'm like, oh, is that yeah, gonna be plot? My bad. But I'm just kind of staring at him in a map. All you guys' items. I was taking all you guys' loot. I'm sorry. I should have been paying attention. I I can move now. Did, did he t did he tell me what to do? I doubt it. No. He did, but you weren't paying attention. No, he didn't oh, even tell me what to do oh, yet. Well. What? what was he telling you then all that time? I don't... I mean, he was basically telling me what's happened since then. Okay, oh, I'm done I'm done with you. I don't need you to repair anything. I'll just... I'll just meet Paladin Tristan at the Rockland Car Tunnel. Sometime. Sometime in the future. I'm not going to be doing that right uh, now. Yeah. That's, uh, what what uh, mission you think we'll be doing next? Uh, we're going to be doing some locations in uh, in DC. Because awesome. you say that it's going to take Wait. eight hours. Yeah, the DC... Unless you ex know exactly where the hell you're going, I don't th see it going really fast. I mean... I've only got like 12... I've done Lost everything else. The metro tunnels half the damn time. Well, I don't there. go through the metro oh, tunnels. Yeah. Fuck the metro tunnels. <laughs> I, I I look at That's them and I go problem. like, where do they go? Okay, no no need for me they to go there. Get to some areas through the metros. Right. Uh, Washington Monument. All right, let, let's start at the Washington Monument and head west. Mm. Hopefully they'll let me do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I it will. I, I remember the monument. It's pretty yeah. cool. Monument is awesome. Uh, oh, oh wait, look at look at the uh, look at the monument. I, I want to say something. Doesn't it remind you? Like, doesn't it look like a tribute to Bill Clinton? Uh, yeah. His would be bigger. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. um, well, as long as it had a huge set of balls with it. Oh, <laughs> uh, they're they're underground. They don't let people into those. <laughs> 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 yes, oh, massive water storage tanks. That's that's real nice. Nice, man. We are classy, aren't we? We, we are, are classy as we, well. Oh come on! Like, 
That's what that's what an obelisk is supposed to be. It's supposed to be a giant penis. I, I mean, that's what it's always <laughs> meant. Yes. Even the ancient Egyptians were like, my oh penis right, was huge. <laughs> look at it. It is bigger than everyone else's around me. We should go back in time and inform them that? that back, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, oh, we're at the the nice the the reflecting pool here, made famous mm -hmm. by uh by Forrest Gump, from what I understand. How deep is it? Yeah, yeah it's like two feet. Uh, yeah, you should jump inside and see how awesome it is and get irradiated. No, the, like the whole point of it is so that you can see the Washington Monument from uh. Ah, I forgot what building that is over there. It's not the Lincoln Memorial. Well, anyway, when you're when you're there, oh look, d location discovered. When you're over there, it's like, oh my God, there's two penises. Holy crap! <laughs> yes, you can see the reflection of your penis in your mom's face. I mean, <laughs> the reflecting pool. Yes, this is the Lincoln Memorial. Sweet. Um, wh why is Fox not with me? Do I have to go back and get Fox? That would suck. Hey, are you going? I, I don't know. Did you talk to him since then? Uh, last I saw him, he he was in the same room with me when we woke up, and then, yeah, he hasn't been following me since. Kind of yeah, pissing me off. Yeah, you might need re-talk re to him and whatnot. What the hell are you doing wandering around here? Oh, easy now. Curiosity can get away from <laughs> Easy now. No need to cause no trouble now. Not like I could blow all your heads off. <laughs> Just I can think oh, about it hard enough oh. and, and you will no longer have heads. What the hell? They all started shooting me. I don't... I don't... I don't know what I said, but Silas is gonna die now. Because apparently they, they all decided to start shooting. <laughs> oh god. What did I say? Yeah, you you must have just let it slip that you know like slavers or whatever. Oh, like, you know, they're slavers. I did not did not realize like that. Yeah, okay, then I don't feel bad about this at all. Oh come on! I want one hit of quitters. There we go. Got him anyway. Who's next? Yeah, don't don't hide or anything like that. Just stand out in the open so I can shoot you. Ow. I might have to use a stim pack. This angers yeah, this me is greatly. This is, <laughs> this is part of the whole quest thing with um, Lincoln and freed slaves and slavers hunting. Part of holding them down and blah, 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 blah. You I'm know. doing it. I, 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 I finally got it's around to that. There's a head wrap. <laughs> it's really symbolic, you know, if you're not, you know blowing shit up like you do. <laughs> hey, I'm still killing the slavers, which is totally what Lincoln was all about. Totally. He was all about murder all the time. <laughs> I've read his works. Yeah, he was he was a, he was a real boner for murder. <laughs> Leroy Walker. Oh, that's right. He's like the leader. It still only takes two <laughs> hits. I remember he said I had to talk to Mr. Walker, and I'm like, okay. And then all of a sudden they started shooting. Like, oh well. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, officer. They started shooting me first. It was in self-defense. I got a always in self-defense. I got I got a quest. Oh, talk to. No, you just completed it. No, it says that I just got it, and now I need to talk to to Hannibal over at um, the whatever the temple. Oh, yeah, you need to talk to the slaves and be all like, hey. I killed all those slavers. <laughs> you can, Do you, you can, <laughs> you can return to your holy ground of the two penis land. <laughs> 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 I have freed you. Yes, all over the place. That's that sounds like. <laughs> there's no, there's like nothing else here. Me. Anything good? There's no way I'm reading all that. If you guys want to read that go to the Lincoln Memorial because there's no way <laughs> uh, this is not Xeno Gears I don't have to read for this game holy crap was <laughs> <laughs> yeah this is like this. Th if you want to read that stuff you should go to the actual Lincoln Memorial yeah seriously I mean, uh, really. and this is just the Gettysburg address over here 
I recognize that. Yeah. Because yeah. it starts with... It would be hilarious. Grammar errors. <laughs> yeah. Well, he wrote it on a napkin. He didn't even, you know... <laughs> like... He wrote, he wrote it on a napkin on the drive yeah, over. Yeah, he wrote his own speech. <laughs> uh, it, like, yeah, on the on the train ride over to Gettysburg, he wrote the, the address on a napkin. It turns out to be one of the best speeches of all time. <laughs> I'm thinking either we're easily impressed or there haven't been that many great speakers in our time. <laughs> I think one of the problems is that they've got, like, six or seven speech writers. All of who are you know fighting over everything, yeah, and that uh, that causes problems. Yeah, so, just, that that's got to be great when you're sitting up there talking about like uh, we should build gates on the border, but we really shouldn't do that. But we should. <laughs> we shouldn't. So yeah, half the time, I don't even know if we should blame the politicians because I think they just like they're reading it off a cue card and they're thinking in their head, "What the fuck am I saying?" <laughs> No, they don't. They don't read legislation. They have people for that. There's like a building over here somewhere. No, like this way. Okay. Don't understand it. So. No, I, I'm pretty sure. Like. So did I say? <laughs> oh God. Wh what? Uh. uh to I, did I say something bad about the Gettysburg Address? Because I swear I just did. Not really. No. Okay. This goes to. Where's this going? My work nesting hole. That does not sound pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I don't see a need to go in there. It's not a location. Like, Wait, where's down here, Marlock? <laughs> there's. There's no need.